Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to learn how to use the Namecheap website builder tool to create your website. And uh, after this video, I will also share my opinion, what I think about this tool and uh, some other tools that you should check out. So this is the tool and uh, first I will give you a preview and demo of this and then I will show you how you can uh, sign up for this tool if you want to use it. So this is the interface and from here you can see all the templates available and website builders are generally a great tool if you want to create a very simple website you don't have to worry about the maintenance part the security part or you know other tech knowledge it's very simple you select a template that is uh, similar or close to your business site that you want to create or any type of website that you want to create and then from there you can replace the content of that template and create your website okay so you can see there are so many templates available and uh, from here you can also see the category of templates for example some of the categories uh, for which i would recommend this kind of website builder tool is if you need a simple website like a personal website or simple service business like if you have a gardening service a cleaning service or something like that so i will show you some of the templates that i liked like this is a simple template okay and you can click on this option to preview so you can preview the template uh, it's a little slow for now uh, in the preview stage here you can see this is the preview of the template we selected and it's a very simple template so if you have a business that uh, needs a website like this so they have a very simple uh, picture they gain some style information here and then there is a simple our story about us block here and then our services their opening time and then uh, some sample work and then this there is the business contact information so if you scroll up here you can see all the pages here if we click here you can see this is uh, another page again it's a very simple just a heading and then some text and these are the style options there is a special offer and all that okay so it directs to the contact page similarly for the main page um, this is the what it looks like it's a very simple there's a little testimonial so this these templates are very simple for very simple type of websites and um, so what you can do is you can add few more sections like you we can add a map here uh, and a few more blocks if you want that we can do uh, so i would recommend it only for very simple website use cases like you if you want to create a portfolio type of website where your customers can find your contact information and then contact your business now if we go back here let's uh, to get look uh, let's take a look at another template so this is a professional cleaning window template and there is a limitation of this tool that uh, you have you can preview one template at a time if you try to view the multiple templates at once then uh, it starts uh, showing 404 errors sometimes okay so again this is a very simple website if you scroll down a uh, nice heading and then there's this image here and then uh, the contact information and what services they offer contact information and uh, some other pages okay so now i will show you how we can uh, edit this content let's close this and you have to use the select option and select it click on yes change template okay so this uh, now we can edit this content okay and from here first it's a very simple thing you can see all the options available here so this is a very simple drag and drop and uh, just you can click and edit a text here if you want okay so like this uh, window you can also change the type heading and etc okay so you can do that it's uh, very simple whatever you want to edit you just have to select it and then from there you can edit this for example if you want to edit this menu you can go here and you can select uh, what each button does where it uh, redirects to for example home will redirect to home page and about us and to this pages we can also add a new menu item here like we can add a option of call us so we can select a link 
and then from here go to phone number and I can go to okay and then click on apply apply now you can see this new button has been added okay so that's how we can edit uh, you don't get a lot of options but this is how it looks like okay so from here you can select the layout you can add a text for picture gallery and uh, most of the advanced options are available here in block section now you can see here there are a lot more header option header is basically the upper part and uh, like this you, if you want we can make a header like this uh, and like this so if you want we can replace our header with this one and you can see a new header has been added so if you want to remove the old header what we have to do is select this block right click. you have to select this right click and then click on remove option okay sometimes the remove option will not be available if you do not uh, select the right element so you have to select this element and then remove it and if you want to undo something then you can do it from here okay let's um, remove this and keep the default header okay all right so similarly um, you can edit this content like you can also double click and edit this content and for this button you can select and on the right side of the window you can see all the settings related to this for example right now it is linked to the contact page we can uh, edit this click on this pencil icon and then from here we can uh, make it a phone number email address or web address or something else okay so we can do that we can also change the color of this button from here if you want we can make it any other color okay so and then if you want to undo this then we can do it from here also if you want to make it big or small or something like that then you can do it just by drag and drop okay and there is a, another option here like you can add okay and if you want to replace an image here you have to select this then you on the right side you will see this option set it from here you can uh, replace this image free gallery let's say you can search for free images from here and i think i like this image so i can select it and select here and you can see we can also upload any other image from our computer and uh, this is just for the demo purpose okay so this is how we can do this and if you want to add a section here then you have to select it where you want to add we can have to click on this plus icon from here you can add this text content picture gallery or these are the shortcuts available or if you want to see more option then click on this blocks option from here you can see uh, about a section here okay so if we want we can add this um, about a section like this you can see it has been added and then from here we can uh, replace this image okay so you can also edit this content and if you want to move this content then you can again select it and you can uh, move this content up and down from here okay so this is how you can edit this page and uh, if you want to add a new page here you can go here and go to edit from here go to new page and then you have to select a copy layout from option so for example i will select about this page and i will name this uh, pricing then click on apply we can we could have also selected the clear body content option so it will just give us a header and footer and then we can add uh, other things then click on apply okay so the new page has been created and we can go and edit this so we can edit this save draft so here you can see uh, this is what we have and we can if you want we can remove all this and then um, add other blocks 
and after doing this we have to just uh, click on this publish or we can also back up and restore and if you don't like this then uh, what you can do is go here and go to change template and from here you can select any other template that uh, you would like now let's learn how you can sign up for this service you have to check the link in the description and from there you can find my referral link because namecheap has multiple type of shared hosting uh, wordpress hosting and other multiple services so make sure that you get the correct hosting which includes this website builder plan not every plan will include this website builder tool from here you have to select the data center location which is closest to your audience and then select the blink cycle so the if you select the annual cycle you will get very good discounts and um, then you have to select which plan you want to go for for example if i select this plan okay then i have to select a new domain name so domain name is basically a website name you can see that this is available so i will click on connect to hosting and then i will you can see the final price here then go to add to cart and from here you have to click on confirm order now if you are new to namecheap then you will have to create an account by filling the simple details and then click on create account and continue then complete the payment so i will show you the steps after completing the payment after completing the payment you will see an option here go to dashboard and you will see this option from here go to hosting list and then go to cpanel okay so it will open a cpanel like this from here you have to go to this website builder option and then you will see this templates option all the templates available okay and then from here you can uh, select a template and then edit its content and create your website it's uh, that simple but in my opinion i didn't really like the namecheap website builder tool i have tried it few years ago and it looked decent at that time it worked decent but right now there are a lot of options available and i do not see any other progress or development being done to this website builder tool by namecheap and if you want to create very simple websites i think you should also check out the godaddy website builder tool it's free to try there is no payment required for trial i have created a video about it from the check in the description you will find a link to that video i think that's a much better option and uh, they have more more decent blogs and templates it's a very much more simpler simple to use tool and if you want something fancy but still want a website builder i think you should check out wix or squarespace they have much more better templates but they are also expensive but uh, it's really difficult to suggest names cheap website builder tool uh, right now because i didn't really like the selection of the templates available the blocks and it looks very outdated um, it's just uh, it doesn't feel like a modern website builder it's very difficult to use and it looks like something that was built 10 years ago and it was never updated again so that's my opinion about this tool and because you cannot try this tool without subscribing to the namecheap plan so i hope this video helps you in making a decision and i would suggest rather than going for this i think you can just uh, use the same hosting namecheap plan and create a WordPress website and select some pre-made template. I think that will be a much better option than the using these outdated templates. So that's about this video. Please let me know your feedback in the comments and if you have any questions or uh, what you think about this tool. And some user have also complained when I was researching about this video that the, it doesn't work very well on the mobile version although i have checked the preview options available the preview versions were great on the mobile and other devices they are completely responsive but after modifying it may not work as good as the default templates and uh, it's users for finding it difficult to properly manage this so that's also feedback